Hi, this is Joe Biden. It's an honor to talk with you at the crossroads, this crossroads moment of our, for our country. And, you know, your voice defines us as our foundation and as our future. Your centuries of sacrifice and service, your resilience, show us the way. But today across our country, trust is ebbing. Hope seems elusive. Instead of working to heal, we're being ripped apart. And I refuse to let that happen. We have too bright a future to leave it shipwrecked on the shoals of anger and division. I've said from the start, I'm running to unite this country, to embrace light, not darkness, the future, not the past, to appeal to the best in us, not the worst. This is the most important election of our lifetimes. It's about hope over fear, science over fiction, truth over lies. It's about facing the often hard facts of where we come from, and honoring the commitments with action. As president, I'll make tribal sovereignty and upholding our federal trust and treaty responsibilities to tribal nations the cornerstone of federal Indian policy. I'll promote self-governance and self-determination and recognize it. I've outlined a detailed plan to strengthen nation-to-nation relationship, building on the progress we made together under the Obama-Biden administration. It It includes putting more land into trust and protecting our natural and cultural treasures, boosting investments in schools, roads, housing, clean water, and broadband, creating good-paying jobs. You know, it increases funding for Indian Health Service, and families makes that funding, and finally goes on and makes that funding mandatory so your families benefit. You know, we'll not only follow steps I laid out back in March to beat COVID, which has been three times more deadly for Native Americans. We're going to build back better and end the inequities in healthcare, in education, and opportunity that this crisis has amplified. I commit to you, tribes will have a say in my administration and a seat at the table. Because in these crises today, the ones we face today, we have an enormous opportunity to build a better future if we do it together. So please get everyone out to vote, friends, family, colleagues, your whole communities. Send them to IWillVote.com. Make a plan to vote today. We can't ever let anyone think their voice doesn't count because the American people, all of us, will decide this election and define our future. So let's spread the word, spread the faith. Let's get to work. God bless you all. And by the way, God bless all those who serve this country.